only the best kind of person would get somebody that as a gift. I did this for a knife, but not. Hey guys, this is a bit random. I am actually on the Isle of Butte right now with a bunch of quite good friends. That's Ranjeev, if you can see him. You <laughs> I'm what? filming you. Yeah, where's my, where's my um, drink? Oh, I'll accredit you. <laughs> That's Elliot. <laughs> and then the Fiona and Ross are down at the sea right now. It's about half three in the morning. And uh, we're just witnessing the sun coming up for the first time. That's Fiona and Ross there at the front there. I don't come to Scotland to shite. We're at the beach now, Ettrick Bay and Rossi, and uh, we got some bubbles, like I was showing you earlier on, and the guys are trying to get my kite to work. We can't make it fly. I'm sad, but I'll keep you updated. I'm sure we'll get it to fly. Keep You managing? Weird is that? They're the bubbles that the girls are blowing with their wands. What? If anyone knows why that happens, let us know. You having fun? and I'll push it. Bar number three.
Dana Ainport triple 20. So that is 28. So we're ready? Yeah. Yeah. You, you can get them. Okay. One. Uh, one. One. Oh, that was oh, shit. One. <laughs> What's that? 17? 19. Nope, that's 20. You're not in the 20. Yeah, that isn't 20. Oh, so you are. 34. So I bet my five. Oh. I told you it was going to be bad. Dun, 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 dun. Over the shoulder. Oh, yes. Over the shoulder. See, that's how it starts. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and the results. 16 and 19. What's that? <laughs> 28, 45, 35, and zero. I have recorded that horribly. I apologize. Sugar drops and gum drops, so what a rain that would be. Standing outside with my mouth open wide. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> well, give your phone a go up the road, right? But just me, I just thought I'd be on my face. I've been on for fucking ages. <laughs> Hi guys, that's me home now. Um, the video that you've just watched probably won't make very much sense to you because it's just a bunch of random clips put together. But um, basically, me and a few friends went to Rossi on the Isle of Butte for the weekend, and it was great fun. We had such a good time. But um, the most exciting part, I guess, was um, on the way back home, the boat that me and Gary and Susie were on actually caught on fire. Um, I'm smiling about it now because thinking back on it I acted ridiculously but it was one of the most scary experiences of my life. A uh, 20 minute ferry ride took about an hour and a half. Yeah, basically the boat just kind of started spinning in the middle of the sea and um, I got a little bit uneasy and I had a little mini panic attack but it's all fine, we made it to dry land safe and sound. <laughs> but yeah, um, I just wanted to update you guys because that was such a random like one-off experience that I hope never happens to anyone ever again. <laughs> but yeah, um, so that was that. I've got another little piece of news for y'all as well. While I was in Rossi, I don't know why I didn't say in an earlier clip, but um, I found out my degree classification. So it is official. I get to leave uni and graduate and um, I'm so excited. Like I finished a few weeks ago, but I didn't, not that I didn't know I was going to graduate. I thought I was, like I was hoping for it, but you know, if I had to reset anything, it would have postponed everything, but it turns out I've passed everything and I now have a second class honours degree, which is crazy. <laughs> it's actually crazy. I wrote a status on Facebook that was something along the lines of normally people would say four years of hard work have paid off, but four years of doing very minimal effort and still managing to pass has worked fine for me and I'm so happy with the second class degree. I couldn't be much happier. And now I can just forget about uni and move on with my life because I hated it so much. <laughs> but yeah, that's not to say everyone will hate it. Some people will like it, but I just didn't like it at all. So now to move on with my life and move to Inverness and experience something new again. So that'll be fun. But yeah, I just thought I'd come on and like tell you guys my little experience before I like sign off and to try and make some sense of the vlog because I was planning on vlogging. I'm still a bit awkward around people, so sometimes I just start filming and don't talk much <laughs> so it's a bit jumpy but regardless i hope you still enjoy it and um, until next time guys i'll see you later bye